right here we're going to be playing some Diablo 2 Eastern Sun Rises. It's the new Diablo 2 Eastern Sun mod. And then somebody patched it, so we're playing the 2018 version. So we go to single player. We already beat this mod. Someone in the comments said, uh, play Diablo 2, play Bozon Hardcore 2 Maker. We already did. We made Javazon Hardcore 2. She just has the Vigor Aura. She just runs absolutely everywhere. She has a burst of speed, right? She should have. Yes, burst of speed. She has Vigor. She runs really fast. She has burst of speed. She runs even faster. She's just crazy in Eastern Sun. She's still not really very good. She's uh, 91, but her gear could still use some upgrades, right? We got all these things here, but we were going to start from the beginning. What are the best things you could get earliest in the game? We're going to see, because I think uh, you were doing all right. We got a orange forged death blade, 510 damage. Ancient armor. You got some pretty sick stuff. Cool. I don't think this took too long. Maybe it took like a couple days, but geez. So Diablo 2 Eastern Sun Rises, it's pretty much the same thing. They didn't add too much, except for we're going to ch uh, make some changes because we noticed the jewels, they changed how the jewels look. We want the old Diablo 2 jewels, right? Uh, shared page. Cause we were collecting things before. These are the jewels. These are what they look like. And then the rings and the amulets, they changed what those look like. Let's turn those to regular Diablo 2. Oh. Uh, yeah, so we made those changes, so then now if we go into the game, if we go look in the inventory, hopefully it doesn't destroy the game and make it so it doesn't load when we go to our inventory. Oh, it did. Okay. Huh. Alright, so uh, we couldn't figure out the items. It kept crashing the game when we uh, took the graphics out. We tried leaving some graphics in, but we have to go change some code, but we got the inventory better, right? We got the better inventory just looks a lot cleaner it doesn't have all those little squares everywhere it's just a simple gray background and then the Roderick cube we also changed this right it's also a super sick simple inventory layout there and then for the mercenary we also did this before we changed uh, his so his looks super sick and super clean and same with the character thing I believe yes we edited this before we added trunks in the background we changed how that looks that looked super sick like that so there we go, all of our stuff looks uh, kind of alright, we got the Roger Cube of Power again, the extra inventory graphics, and then the starting screen, Eastern Sun mod hardcore guides when we're editing the screen, single player. We even got the custom uh, character select screen here like we had before with Trunks and Goku and Vegeta. So now let's uh, start again, let's do starting from Bloodmore. Oh, and then if anyone's wondering, this is what it originally lo uh, looks like, the title screen. This is what usually the character screen looks like. But we change things because we could go into the code, into the pictures. We could modify modify the game a bit to our liking. This is what the normal inventory looked like, right? It just had uh, those, it had all the squares and everything. And then the same with the mercenary. The mercenary looked pretty old and clunky, just like Diablo 2 did. It didn't look as clean as it did before. And then the Roderick Cube, right? It had all those squares. Those squares, they looked bad, so we got rid of them. And then same with the character screen. It just looked all old and outdated, so we changed it at one point. So those were the user interfaces we changed. We made them look a lot better. Definitely looks a lot cleaner the way we did it. All right, so we did uh, get the jewels in the game like we wanted, right? We got all the original colored, colored jewels. So now we wanted to make them different because we noticed... Uh, these ones, they look exactly the same, so I don't know, maybe we could change the colors a little bit. There we go, yeah, so there's the new jewels. Now it should appear in the game, right? There's the old jewel. Then we go save and exit. Then we go single player, then we go log in. So we should change the background, but we're still doing things. So now if we go to our inventory, now if we go to the jewels, cool, now there's a whole new jewel, so now it looks different than the other one. Wow, that's cool. We can make our own jewel items. Huh, maybe we should just uh, colorize all of them. That would be something. Yeah, just make them a lighter blue color so they all look different than the original. So these are the original jewels. Uh, the other jewels, they were from some other game. We didn't want those ones. All right, so uh, we started editing them like these to change the colors a little bit. And then we thought uh, we could just make our own gems. We could make our own from scratch. So we just made our own gems. We made the... Uh, white gem, the black gem, the yellow gem, the red gem, the green gem, the blue gem, 
So there's all the gems. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then we're going to have to make our own ring graphics and everything. So now when we pick up a gem, it's going to be super simple. It's going to go with the inventory. Maybe we should uh, change the graphics of like every item. We could make our own ancient bow. We could make our own gloves, make our own armor. We could just make it all super simple. <laughs> Yeah, that'd be nice. Ah, uh, there, and then you could just uh, equip everything. So I don't know how we're going to change that. Let's try changing the ancient bow, see if it'll work. All right, here, so we did make some progress. We made our own bow, right? We got our own gems now, we made them. We got our own bow, but actually, we didn't have the black background. So here, we could uh, save and exit, we fixed it. Single player, there's so many things you could do with Diablo 2. You could just change all of the graphics. Now it is fixed. There we go. Now there's the ancient bow, the long war bow. That's what the long war bow looks like now. Now we could just change everything in the game. That is so cool. <laughs> what the heck? Now we got a, our own custom jewels. We got our own custom bow. And then we could make uh, all of the items custom. It would just be Diablo 2 Eastern Sun, the custom mods. We have to make our own uh, charm graphics and everything. We have to make our own item graphics and everything have to do everything we have to customize our own game so then here's what the original arrows look like so we're just going to maybe play through the game we were going to go through act one do blood more get a bunch of items from there and gear out every character but the inventory graphics i guess we could do the inventory graphics too as we play the game right so we're playing the game we're discovering what are the best items in each of the areas and then we're also uh, changing the inventory graphics so they look different so now we arrows they're gonna be our own custom arrows and if we go to the store here she's gonna sell the new custom arrows yes cool now i have to make new custom bolts and everything so everything is just gonna be simple simple colors simple sweet we could make our own game